listen to this or we get another one. Welcome. Welcome, everybody, to our 2022 live holiday Wooly News. Today, we're going to talk to winter sports teams, compete in some holiday challenges, and reminisce on Christmas past. Today, we are joined by the eighth grade band members, and welcome. <laughs> cookie decorating so we got Elise and Fatima versus Mr. Ruck and Miss Cody uh, each group will have about 20 minutes to decorate their cookies and we're going to check in throughout the show to see how you're doing and after our show you can vote on Instagram for your favorite alright so we got a question are you guys feeling confident yeah definitely I think we can take them yeah <laughs> <laughs> how do you guys feel over here I think They're, they're really dissing you guys. All right. Are you guys ready? All right. Three, two, one, go. All right. Now we're going to head over to boys basketball. We're going to have some questions for them. All right. Hi, I'm Carter alongside Jake. Uh, today we'll be talking with the winter sports teams. Uh, we have Lucas, Tyler, and Anthony Filippo and Matt Kelly from boys basketball. So first and foremost, um, how's your season going so far? Uh, my season's going well. Started off hot, winning three straight home games, and then we fell short to Prouty um, the other day. Um, but I think we're playing really well. I mean, long season, um, so there's a lot more to come. Anyone else? Yeah, season's going great. Uh, tough loss, though. On, uh, yeah. So uh, we all want to know, when is your next game? Where is it at? What time? Uh, next game's at Walpole um, on the 27th for a holiday tournament. And I think it's at 4 o'clock. It's a pretty big game, bigger competition. All right, so we don't want to look too far um, into the future, but what are some like big games you guys are looking forward to this season? Uh, definitely Springfield uh, on the 17th. Definitely them. Lots of them in the playoffs last year. It'll be a good, good redemption game. I'm looking forward to Grafton. It's always a good game. Uh, I think we split with them last year, so 
they only want to play us once this year, so if we can get a win there, that'd be good. And um, who are some younger players um, you should be, or everyone should be watching out for for this season? Uh, definitely watch out for Jaden Dawu. He's a point guard. <laughs> Very good. Uh, probably Jaden or n my boy Nolan Clark. Nolan Clark, watch out for him. Uh, definitely Matthias Ware, sophomore. Um, I mean he's getting really good. Uh, he can do anything, just about anything for the team. Helps out in any way. All right, so what are your team's entrance ritual or uh, team handshake? You got any special ones? I mean, we all go through handshake lines uh, once our name gets called to um, be introduced. Uh, for me personally, it's just a simple fist bump with Kaz, our handshake guy. Uh, you know, I'm a shooter, so I hit the crossbow, Kaz. And then uh, usually after games, we play uh, Ain't No Mountain High Enough. After a nice win, gets the vibes going. Go Wolves. Uh, the cheer team and pep band are always great at these games, too. We had a chance to talk with them during the Thanksgiving show. All right, thank you, boys, basketball. So now we're going to talk with Kaylee and Gianna, and they're going to answer a Christmas question for us. So uh, thinking back on Christmas, past Christmases, when uh, you guys were little, what was the gift that you guys were always excited about getting? A gift I was excited about getting was a new phone, because I had a six, and everyone else had like a better phone than me, so I was kind of jealous, and I got a 10, so it was pretty exciting. My favorite gift that I've gotten was probably when I was like really little. It was one of those fake kitchen things that you like that has like all the little um like silverware stuff. So like All right, so now we're going to we're going to go over and talk to the hockey <coughs> hockey fellas. We got Nolan White and uh Mike Monfrida. How are you guys season going so far? Uh we're not bad. You know, we're a young team. We're 2-2 two and two so far. We uh, had a tough loss to Neshoba and uh, Hopedale, but we got wins against Worcester and uh, Westfield uh, last week. And we got a game tonight at uh, at North Star and Westboro at 8-15. Other than that, pretty, pretty solid. All right, so uh, who are you guys' uh, biggest rivals for the Millbury and Auburn? Like hockey teams. Uh, this year it's uh, Wachusett. We're playing Wachusett at the DCU Center January 23rd at 2. Um, usually it's Hudson, but we don't play them. <coughs> All right, so um, what do you think you guys, uh, next game you recommend people going to? Is there a big game that's that people should um, come and pop out for? I would say the 28th uh, against Westfield at uh, Horgan. I think that game goes here at 2? Yeah, uh, game at 2 at Horgan. Uh, yeah, I mean, we beat we beat, we beat uh, Westfield 4 nothing last time, so I'm you know, hoping for another W. All right, thank you. So the band's going to play again. <laughs> So now we got the the gift gift wrapping challenge. Uh, we got Mr. Lowe, Miss Rigney, Nick, Jenna, and Mr. Mara wrapping today. 
So you guys all have random objects, and each contestant is going to get a chance to pick the object they want to wrap. And the present must be completely wrapped, and time and quality will be judged in this co contest. Time, time and quality? And quality. Yeah. Time and okay, quality. okay, good. Okay. So the picking present order will be decided on holiday movie release dates. Um, whoever comes closest to the release date will choose first, and then so on. Whoever second, second. There you go. So Matt's going to ask you the question. So in what year was the original Home Alone movie released? Okay. Just go down the line. Dad. 2004. 1992. Which question? <laughs> 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 so in what year was the original Home Alone movie released? Look at difference. 1993. It's 1996. Miss Rigney, you said 94. Um, All right, Mr. Lowe, then Mr. Mara, then Nick, then Jenna. What year did it come out? 1990. Oh. Should have done year one. Year I went up, man. Yeah. So, so you you pick, yeah, you pick, pick first. One you want. All right, Mr. Mara. I'll take this. Nick. <laughs> <laughs> and Jenna gets left with the oh, oh, just almo one. almost 15 years <laughs> off. Not too bad. All right, guys, get all ready and let me know when you guys are all set up. No, wait, we need I don't believe so. Competition has already started and the timer hasn't even gone off. I'm gonna count. I'm gonna count you guys down. So just they're, they're ready to go. Wait a minute. Do we have enough here? <laughs> it's intense in here, everybody. Uh, you want to go? go? Oh, you do. Yeah. All right. Are you guys ready? <laughs> All right. Ready? Three, two, one. Start. It's not big enough. It's not big enough. Bummer. <laughs> this is not fair. Nick's on the floor over here. Oh. Nick has Nick has the Strong best approach going. Strong start by Miss Rigney. He does have a. <laughs> oh, some <laughs> sabotaging. Going on. Oh. Is this allowed? I don't know if this is allowed. Oh. Man is on the field. Goals were not established, so this is fair play. <laughs> oh! Ripped it open. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Whatever. Jenna's struggling here. Jenna's She's going to move to the ground. Uh, <laughs> okay, we got Jenna and Nick's Nick working both hard. on the floor. It was almost done. Done. Hello. No, I, you know what? <laughs> I guess we got a winner. Mr. So Lowe's the winner? <laughs> I mean, that's... That his quality is right. definitely better. Are you gonna bring up the fact? What yeah, I know. What is this? <laughs> My paper wasn't <laughs> big enough. It wasn't big enough for the other. This item. was gonna be perfect, and there's holes in it. Why? I just want everyone. That's actually pretty impressive. <laughs> that was pretty good. That was pretty good. I'm don't look at the back, mm. but let's let's turn it around. Turn it. Shaky. All right, it's still covered. Be worse off it's than last. Uh, well, it's debatable. <laughs> debatable. Let me finish. Let me finish. Yeah. Nick, finish. you have like a you have a hole. I didn't fit. It didn't fit. <laughs> I also need to have the one that had no tape. <laughs> <laughs> it was like the hole. Oh my god. Okay. I, 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 I strategically gave her. Because I was going to win. You were going to win. I was going to win. You were going to win. By a landslide. All right. This was great. Looks like we definitely have a winner. No, I'm not even done. Time's out. Time's up. All right, so now we're going over to girls basketball, and Jake and Carter are going to take it from here. All right, so we got girls basketball. We got Ashley, Emma, Bianca, and Lacey. Um, so how is your season going so far? The season's going good. Uh, we started off 3-0, and 
we had uh, wins against Leicester, David Prouty, and then a big win against Sutton. All right, so for your next game, where is that? What time is that? What's the date? So our next game is when we come back from break. It's, well, it's Tuesday, the 2nd of January, and it's against Southbridge. Um, yeah, I know. I know, but that's our next regular season game. And then, like, we have a holiday tournament next week that we're going to be playing in at Newton North, which is going to be a good challenge for us. All right, so what are some upcoming big games you guys are looking forward to? <laughs> um, probably Grafton at the end of the season. We played them the l our last game, and definitely Northbridge. So who are some of the younger players on the team that we should be watching out for this season? Uh, yeah, so we have a pretty young team this year. But we have um, players like Reyna, Mila, Riley, and Brielle that have found their way into the starting lineups for uh, matchups. And then even though Alana is a junior, Alana has been lighting it up at the three-point line. So. All right. And then last, uh, what is your team's entrance ritual? Um, before we go out to the gym, we usually listen to, like, a speech and um, – then we usually huddle up before we go out for layups. <laughs> That's it. <laughs> Thank you, girls. Thank you, girls basketball. Uh, now we are going to go check in on the cookie decorating. Um, it looks pretty good so far. Uh, how do you guys feel about your? Oh, Miss Cody, how do how do you guys feel about your cookies so far? Isaac just fell out of the bag. I made some new friends. So now we're gonna we're gonna go to the band. <laughs> Now we're here with track. All right, so uh, we're here with. Uh, uh, I'm Jamal. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> I'm Lauren. Uh, I'm Jenna. I'm Nick. I'm Chris. I'm Well. I'm Jason. <laughs> I'm Nolan. And I'm Callie. <laughs> All right, guys. So how's your season going so far? Uh, we've only had one meet so far. We have another meet today. <coughs> Girls team small, but they're doing well. And our boys team came in second, and Tantasco beat us. So. All right. So, uh, what events did each of you guys com uh, like participate in? So I participate in the 300 and the 4x2 relay. Do uh, 55 hurdles. Uh, I throw the shot put. I do the two mile and the 1,000 meter. I also throw shot put. Um, I run the four by two, the 55, and I throw shot put. I do the 50 and the four by two. I do shot put and 55 hurdles. I do the 4 by 2 600, and I high jump. All right, so what are, some, what are your guys' upcoming meets? All right, so uh, we actually have a meet today. Um, we're at Northbridge and next to Royal. All right, so who are some of uh, the younger players that we should be watching out for this season? 
Um, for the girls team, Danielle Gilbert. <laughs> she runs the 50 and the she runs the four by two with us. And also Mariah, she also runs the four by two. Um, we got Bryson McCarthy. Um, he runs the 600 with uh, Mateus. Um, who else is there? I feel like my uh, Sergio. He's pretty quick. Oh, Chase Conlon, great shot put. And then not young, but Ryan Gleason. He's not here. Yeah, he's pretty quick at the 300. Oh, Aiden Dubois, Jay Bly. They throw the shot put. <coughs> oh, um, Dylan Curran. He throws the shot put. Jamie, yeah, we'll pass it to Will, who runs. All right, uh, I'd say Jamie Hosier. He's definitely got a future ahead of him. That you go. Oh, oh, oh. <laughs> um, Anthony Powell, he, uh, he's got a bright future ahead of him. Anyone else? Next question. All right, guys, so do you have any superstitions or pregame rituals? Um, I don't tie my shoes when I warm up. Um, we used to have one. We wear two different socks, one black and one white. <laughs> Can't really do that anymore, though, so. <laughs> I did the same as Jenna. Uh, the night before a meet, I take an Epsom salt bath and just, you know, <laughs> you know, helps me. And I think I run well, so. Um, something I do is, like, I know a lot of us do it. We don't put our shoes on until, like, right before we're racing. We just, like, hang out, but. I don't do anything. I don't believe in superstitions. Um, if you drop the baton, you have to drop it again. Uh, I don't know if this counts, but I always like load up on carbs. Like I always have like pasta or something the night before. Um, I like linguine. I like penne. <laughs> um, I don't know any kind. Yeah, of course, red sauce. Maybe some meatballs sometimes. All right. Okay. All right. We're going to bring it back to the band. We're going back over to Cookies. Once we're done. Once we're done um, how's it going, everyone? Yeah. Come to <laughs> you done? All right. Who do, you think, uh, who do you think is the the winner over here? Can we flip them towards us if we can? That's without rolling off the table. Like that in that camp over here. That's cute. I I do like the color. The design on this this one right here, but I think the most clean one would have to be Miss Cody's. Ooh. I think it's the most put together one out of all yeah. four. I think so too. I mean, they're all good. I like Miss Celeste, but I mean, I think Miss I think Miss Cody does s uh, steal the. I'm, I'm a big quality guy. I think quality takes the. Take, so. But if you guys have a different opinion, you can go vote on Instagram. Um, the pictures will be up. So there we go. So band, thank you guys for playing. You guys are gonna have an awesome season. Great work. Now we're also naming that. We can get a round of applause for band. <laughs> guys, nice job. All right, so up next, they're setting up. We have a uh, Name That Tune contest. So we got George and DePapa, Jenna, Lacey, uh, Santino, and Matthias. And we're supposed to have two freshmen, but, freshmen are they, scared, but so they didn't show up. So are the freshmen. Yeah. Uh, no, no, no. Freshmen are scared. I mean, me and Jamel I mean can fill in. Yeah, I mean, if you guys really need. No, no. 
people. You scared? Yeah, yeah, yeah. This guy, this guy's shaking in his boots over there. Give us that white boy. They don't want it. All right, so Gianna is going to sing a part of a song in the contest. The contestants are going to guess what they think it is. Uh, contestants will write their answers on the whiteboard, and if it's not on there, then you don't even get the point. Um, and players with the highest score at the end wins. There is no prize. Okay, the first one. Is everyone ready? Make sure you're not cheating and looking at the board, because I don't know if you guys can see it over there. Okay, listen up. Oh, wait. Thank you. I can see me now on Christmas morning creeping down the stairs. <coughs> oh, what joy and what surprise when I open up my eyes. Wow. So that's the first one. Thank that, you. Was, that was really good. That was a little warm up for me. Yeah, that was good. Like She's still warming there. up, guys. So. Stop laughing, Nolan. <laughs> Is writing, I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. No cheating, you're gonna get disqualified. If you cheat, <laughs> Matt's gonna go over and check the answers. Gosh, I don't really know the winner. Okay, they don't have an just answer. wrap it up, wrap it up. I need to get to the next one. Okay, Woo! juniors and seniors. That both was have I want a hippopotamus for Christmas. Dude, I was right. All right, next next song. Are you guys ready? No cheating in the back. Ready? Are you guys ready? Oh, you didn't get the last one. That's the island greeting that we send to you from the land where palm trees sway. Here we know that Christmas will be green and bright, the sun to shine by day and all the stars at night. Is it all, <laughs> all right, that was <laughs> like it's not funny that he's filming me. <laughs> no, 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 no. It was, they had the right idea. They had the right idea. That was Malika Leaky Maka. <laughs> All right. We're giving him the point. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Okay, the next one. Just like the ones I used to know. Where the tree tops glisten <laughs> and the children listen to hear sleigh bells in the snow. You know this one, Santino. You know it. <laughs> All right. I like your exclamation point. <laughs> you know it. You know it. <laughs> All right. George, I like the exclamation point at the end. You guys got one second, then you got to flip the boards. <laughs> Dude, that's it. Besides, what'd you write down? Do you want that? Let it snow. All right, right. White seniors Christmas. point. Christmas. Score right now, seniors three, juniors one, and sophomores zero. All right, next song. I'm disappointed in you, Santino. What did you write? <laughs> okay, so somebody chose for this one to be, this one's super easy. It's a classic, but it's, I'm singing it in Spanish. Alright, You would if you don't know this, Matthias, I'm gonna be disappointed. Like you can just tell. Shut up. I'll just sing the two first things. Ready? Like why? Noche de paz, noche de amor. Give me that. Can you repeat 
keep saying it. That's all I'll give you. I know that. Are you serious? Sing it. Keep singing. Can we get a repeat? Yeah, she'll repeat it. Noche de paz. Noche de amor. What is he saying over here? Try to translate that the best you can. Well, right now, the seniors the four, the juniors the two, and sophomores <laughs> nine. The pop is bilingual. I, I took French. So. <laughs> oh, <laughs> trilingual. All right, Matt, what do they? What do you got? All right, <laughs> sophomores again with the fail. Good, they just like yeah, they got night though. <laughs> okay, well. <laughs> Yeah, sure. Yeah, we got a half a point half for the sophomores. Mark. All right, so next song. Here we go. Okay, we have two more. So, all right. Wait, can we do like an extra point? Yeah, well, there's going to be an extra point. If you get it, you can win. We'll make it that way. Okay? Okay. okay. That's not I know. Once bitten and twice shy. I keep my distance, but you still catch my eye. Tell me, baby. Do you recognize me? <laughs> well, it's yeah. been a year. It doesn't surprise <laughs> me. <laughs> yes. I picked it for a reason, Santino. Like you, you, you have to know this. <laughs> Sophomores, come on. I'm not singing that again. No, we don't need to. <laughs> 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 Just put a random answer. Sing the last lyric so they know. Well, it's been a year. It doesn't surprise me. All right, Matt. They put Santa Baby. Do it. The juniors said Santa Baby. The seniors again. Hey, Papa, what do you think it? What do you think it was? Uh, the lo- the answer was, you think it was last Christmas. <laughs> Seniors were the only one who got that. Dude, so, all right, it was better than nothing. Okay, so this is the extra one. This song does not have a title, but if you can guess what name the this is from, like what movie it's from, you can win. What? So she's gonna sing the song, and it's from a movie, but you have to guess the movie and not the song. It's pretty iconic, so. No. It's a Christmas it's a Christmas, Christmas movie. Uh, I Mr. White Christmas. I Mr. Snow. Oh. I Mr. <laughs> Icicle. I Mr. <laughs> Ten Below. Friends it. call me Snow Miser. Oh what? Oh <laughs> 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 okay. No, that's not. That's not it. It's, it's from that movie. No, it's no. not. All right. It is. <laughs> okay. <laughs> if you have your answers, please no, please I say what you've got. Bro. All right. Show your boards. <laughs> <laughs> All right. The, the answer s- was. The senior <laughs> said the the year without Santa Claus. The junior said what? Uh, Rudolph. Rudolph. <laughs> and the <laughs> sophomore said Frosty the Snowman. So. Um, no, the answer was the year without a Santa Claus. You're Which close, though. The seniors Frosty did the have. Snowman was made by the same oh. people, but uh, we forgot. Yeah, we do one more. When's round two? Um, yeah, no. le- yeah. Let's do like one more. We're on to the next segment. <laughs> yep. All right. Thank you. Did we win anything? <laughs> nope. The score no was six seniors, two juniors, and nothing to sophomores. Oh, sorry, sorry. Point five. They got point five. Half. Like post game interview, that's have anything to say? Uh, rough loss. You know we'll bounce back next time. Uh, so what did you guys? Did you guys ask for anything special for Christmas this year? Oh yeah. Uh, Talking mic. Right here. Oh, right here. Yeah. Uh, I asked Santa to get me. Oh, okay. oh, 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 o
Okay, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. Right. I asked Santa to get me a G.O.D. chain. That's number one on the Christmas list, so, yeah. I asked for Legos. Legos. Lego City, to be exact. I want to build it over Christmas break. Both, both valid gifts. All right. So now Thank we got guys. John and Jaden. They're going to give us, oh, and Nolan. Nolan. They're going to give us a nice little outro. Thank you guys. Hope you guys enjoyed the. Uh, oh, oh, that's not it. Sorry. Oh, 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 one more. All right. Hold on. Um. Uh, I hope everybody has a happy holiday. And here, thank you, John, for setting that up for us. And hope you guys enjoy. Nice they're gonna outro here. Yeah, they're gonna play us out. Here we go. <laughs> Can we get like a jazz beat?